guys, what's going on? My name's Eclipse, and today we will be attempting to get a three crown without touching any of the arena towers. Basically, I'm just going to be mirroring goblin barrels, sending rockets, zapping, and pretty much doing whatever I can to take down the crown tower before the enemy beats me. So I already recorded this video once, and I failed all three times, but all my footage got corrupted, so I'm here to record this again. And since all the attempts last time were fails, hopefully we can actually have somewhat of a success this time. So right away, we're against Rafarme from Mitosis, and this guy is a level 8. Going up against someone who's a lower level is like the best thing ever just because their crown towers don't have a lot of health. And that guy has a sparky right there, so I zap that out. Come on, goblins, go to town. That guy did have a musketeer that did do some work, but I have guards to stop that sparky, and that mega minion is most likely going to go straight. So this guy does have a balloon, so let's pull the balloon over there. Next, oh my god, a wizard. You gotta be kidding me. So, this guy right here is kind of gonna screw me up. Let's just rocket that. Please, Sparky, no, shut up. Yes, we stopped the guy's push. I was afraid that dude Sparky would do some work, but thankfully, we stopped it just in time. So, let's get another pump up. I'm thinking about actually mirroring my pump instead of mirroring the goblin barrels. I'm not too sure on that, though. Let's just think so. Um, you know what? Since this guy did just start a push, let's just start mirroring these pumps. And I know this guy has a Mega Minion, a Balloon, and a Wizard. So there isn't too much I have to stop this guy here. Okay, we're gonna have to zap, boom, boom. Come on, you can do it. Plus that, guys. This is how you stop the Sparky. Get out of here, dude. Okay, so we managed... Oh, we didn't even stop that guy's Sparky. Let's get down that cannon right there. That should help us take out the guy's Wizard. We still have two pumps down, and I'm about to get two more pumps down and once we have this entire back row filled we should be good so this guy did just put a balloon down but I can always rocket that so it's two times elixir I have a whole bunch of pumps and this guy is about to get fried so I'm thinking about just rocketing out this guy sparky that seems like the best thing to do so let's get a rocket ready right there oh my god I might have just missed that rocket okay so we didn't miss that rocket let's pull the balloon to the side unfortunately I did miss that so the balloon is over there going to town which does kind of suck but what are you gonna do next guys it is time let's just let's go all in this guy's most likely gonna three crown me but on the bright side okay let's zap that please oh god guys we might actually lose right here we need to get these guards down quick let's get a cannon down he just countered my push and right now I am not happy with how things are turning out let's just get this push going again let's get another goblin barrel down in the very back with a raid spell come on please let's also time his zap when he has a spear goblins okay he had a mega minion and right now things are not going too well so the first battle was a fail but we did have a pretty strong start so as long as I can emulate this again I'm hoping things go a little bit better so let's just get searching and get right into another battle right now we're against Dan camp from the Roman clash and to start things off I'm thinking about putting a pump down in the very back this guy does have a skeleton army but I can always just zap that out right there but then I can use guards to take care of that mini P.E.K.K.A. now this guy does have some <coughs> Oh my god, I just like choked. This guy did have some fire spirits, but those weren't too big of a deal either. So right now, I'm thinking about putting a rocket on that king tower. He doesn't have any troops pushing, so let's just assume he's going to put something down like right about now. So hopefully this guy does put a troop down. Come on, please put a troop right on the rocket. And unfortunately, he didn't. So right here, we do actually have to worry about this kind of. Let's get a zap ready. Come on, zap all that right there. And yeah, so this guy's pushed. Oh my god, he has minions. Those minions are doing work. Okay, luckily we countered those. Next, I'm thinking about putting the goblin barrels here. I don't know if this guy does have a zap. So, defensive goblin barrel, let's get it, plus some guards. Come on, yes. Oh my god, we stopped that mini P.E.K.K.A. just in time. So, this guy just keeps spamming troops, and I can't even get any pushes off. So, let's just keep pumping up and see what happens. I might mirror the pump if I can. I assume this guy is going to send a Valkyrie goblin. Oh, okay, never mind. No Valkyrie for this guy so let's just put a cannon down um, I'm not gonna waste a zap on that skeleton army it's not too big of a deal so yeah there goes that guy's skeleton army they might get a few yeah they got a few hits off but again nothing too special let's send a rocket in right now and hopefully he puts a troop down come on okay no rocket so right now let's just zap all of that right there I'm actually gonna put a defensive goblin barrel down it's not the best placement but it is something I'm actually gonna put some guards down for those fire spirits and right now things are not going good 
good for us whatsoever. I feel like I just can't time anything right and I can't get to this guy's king tower. So hopefully once two times elixir starts we can pull something off but at this point I don't see this battle really going anywhere. So let's just get three pumps down and see what happens for us now. That guy did just put a Valkyrie in the back so once this guy's push is over I'm thinking we can start things up and make some plays. So let's actually zap all that right there. That was a perfect zap. Let's get that down. Now I do need to get my mirrors in stock ASAP. So are you guys ready for this? We're going to send a rocket in. Then once that rocket goes down, we need to wait until we're back at 10 elixir. So let's do goblin barrel, goblin barrel, plus a rage. Oh, I screwed up. Oh my God. I was such a failure. I only sent one goblin barrel in. Oh my God. I'm actually kind of salty about that now. So let's zap all that out. And guys, let's try this again. But this time we won't fail. And that guy's Valkyrie almost just went in right there. So we need to get another okay crap let's focus let's just oh my god i did not mean to drop a rocket there okay oh well let's just try to get another push going so i know what we're gonna do we're gonna put goblin barrel right there goblin barrel right there and we're gonna get a rage plus a zap down as well okay i zapped the wrong side apparently and yeah so this push isn't going too well and this guy is gonna win any second um okay let's rocket all that come on please rocket and Yes, that was a godly rocket. Unfortunately, his skeleton army is going to get a few hits off, so let's stop those. And now it is time to do the exact same thing all over again. Let's get a zap down in the back. Come on. Oh my god, I'm missing the zaps every time. We have to get this down. This guy's tower is at 1400 HP, and I'm actually having some hope. Um, let's just keep putting some guards down. The guards should be good at holding all this off. Hopefully, come on. There's two hit points left. No, we lost. We were actually doing pretty well that time so unfortunately we've done two battles and lost both of those but this battle went a little bit better than the previous two okay let's get into another battle this time and this time I'm not gonna waste any of my rockets that last battle I felt like I wasn't using the rocket enough and when I did use it it was somewhat of a waste so now that I kind of learned that hopefully we can have some success so since this guy is a level 9 that kind of puts me at a disadvantage because our king towers are the same so let's get a zap right there that was a perfect zap next let's get some fire spirits down and that should take out almost all of the barbs actually oh my god okay this guy's barbs are level 10 so I'm not sure why all of these players at like 2,000 trophies have such crazy card levels but it's pretty annoying so defensive goblin barrel right there we just have to take those archers out come on okay things aren't going too well right now this guy does have a minion horde so let's rocket that out of there please don't miss yes okay so this guy is gonna piss me off I know that for a fact so let's just get a cannon down to take care of this and I'm just gonna continue to pump up until two times elixir and once that happens we should be good but this guy is not giving me a fun time I'm just telling you guys that right now so that right there was a pretty terrible zap let's put a defensive goblin barrel again and I'm kind of upset because things are pretty trashy right now the goblins are pushing up but still no major play so right now I'm just gonna rock it out that spawner screw that guy spawner let's get another cannon down and we should should be good you know I might just try to pick off one tower I'm not too sure on what the game plan is yet okay let's mirror the pump and get another pump down I assume this guy actually is gonna place bar oh no barb so we should be good we just have to time that zap right that was actually a perfect zap so we shouldn't take any damage and luckily we can actually zap again and also I assume this guy's gonna have a spawner any second so where's that you know what let's just get one push going right now let's get a rocket down as well right now I have zero elixir so that's not not too good for me how much damage do we actually just pull off right there that was actually a really good push since it is two times elixir I'm actually gonna get some hope for us right now um this guy did put archers again um we're actually gonna zap all of those please yes we're hanging in there the tower is not down yet we should actually have some hope for this so we have the mirror ready let's go boom 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 we also need to get a, or a zap ready zap it or what I would zap that right there please yes guys this one is actually going really well let's get a rocket down I'm feeling one more push and we might be good however we do have some problems over here this guy has a lot of stuff just you know piling up on me right now so those okay that was a waste of a rage spell kind of um, you know, let's just continue this up and we need one more push off and we should be good I'm gonna zap all that. Oh my god. I missed all the troops. Okay, we're good We just can't panic and we should be fine. Let's get some fire spirits down right there I'm actually gonna mirror the fire spirits just to play that safe and right now 
No, we lost the battle ended. I thought it was tied. Oh my god, I got the tower below a thousand hit points. I thought we were gonna push overtime for some reason. So I've tried this challenge at least six times now, and all six of my attempts have failed. So if you guys want to go ahead and give this a shot on your own, please feel free and do so. You can tweet me the results, comment your results on this video. Basically, just try this out for yourself. Do one to two battles and let me know how it goes for you. And trust me, this is a really hard challenge it's not easy and the only way you'll probably end up winning this is if the enemy is a lower level and they don't have a zap spell but please try this out and let me know how it goes for you guys and if you guys made it this far then you obviously enjoyed it so please give the video a like down below but guys this has been eclipse and peace out <laughs>